The moon is disappearing. It's orbiting further and further away from Earth. For billions of years, the ocean's tides have exerted a drag on the Earth's rotation, causing it to slow down. The same tidal force on Earth exerts a gravitational force on the moon, causing its orbit to speed up. As the moon's orbit gets faster, it moves away to conserve something known as angular momentum. This is the same angular momentum which is conserved when a chair swing ride spins faster and the chairs move away from the center. Compared with its average distance of 385,000 kilometers from Earth, the moon's current rate of departure of 3.78 centimeters per year is vanishingly small. In other words, our lunar companion is unlikely to vanish anytime soon. But what if the moon did disappear and it happened overnight? Before we consider the obvious effect on the oceans, there are two less obvious effects on the Earth's weather. In the 1990s, three scientists from Arizona State University studied 17 years of satellite data and found the moon very slightly warms the Earth. This effect is most pronounced at the poles, where it is 0.55 Celsius warmer during a full moon compared with a new moon, whilst there was no detectable effect in the tropics. Whilst it's warmer at the North Pole during a full moon, it's wetter around the world. Just as the moon causes the seas to rise and fall, it also tugs at the atmosphere, resulting in rising and falling air pressure. This, in turn, affects weather patterns and causes a 1% increase in rainfall during a full moon. Although, if we lost the moon, these imperceptible differences would be the least of our concerns. Whilst the sun contributes a small amount towards ocean tides, without the moon these tides would be a third of their current size. As well as being problematic for fishing boats, surfers, sea turtles and many other intertidal dwellers, the world's weather would be turned on its head. Tides affect our weather by triggering the circulation of warm and cold water around the globe. Without the Atlantic meridional overturning circulation, the UK's climate would be more like Newfoundland. And without the Pacific's Humboldt current, the Atacama Desert would become much wetter. But even these changes would be dwarfed by what would come about if we lost the Moon's stabilising influence on our climate. The Earth currently spins around an axis tilted at 23.4 degrees. This tilt periodically wobbles between 21.1 and 24.5 degrees, with a full oscillation taking 26,000 years to complete. However, without the gravitational pull from both the Sun and the Moon, the Earth would wobble violently. Sometimes there'd be no tilt and no seasons. Other times, the Earth would be extremely tilted, with some parts of the globe experiencing constant heat and others diving headfirst into permanent darkness for months at a time. There wouldn't even be a full moon to light up the skies. Thank goodness it's not disappearing anytime soon. Thank you for watching this video about how the Earth would fare if it lost its lunar companion. Did you realise how much of an influence the Moon has on the Earth's climate? Let us know in the comments what you think. If you enjoyed this, you'll be able to find more hypothetical videos in our What If playlist. And of course, make sure you subscribe to the Met Office Learn About Weather channel so you don't miss our latest videos.